Yo, what's going on guys, it is your boy the Boons here and welcome back to a brand new video on the channel and today we're going to be reacting to WWE most savage moments ever. If you guys do enjoy this reaction, don't forget to leave a like and also subscribe to the channel if you're new around here. We're on the road to 400 subscribers. If you have not subscribed, what the hell are you doing? It's free to do is hit the big up button down below. Right, let's get into the reaction. You're looking to upgrade to a real man, I'm available. Oh. Wow. That is so fucked up. I don't really think that was necessary at all. That was just disgusting. A bitter man. Paybacks and your wife have a lot in common. They're both a bitch. <laughs> in my last conversation with your dad. Oh, this was you, recent. Cody were his favorite son. But Roman Reigns was the son he always wanted. Wow. That promo was so good. I love that promo so much. You won't have one arm tied behind your back. You will have both of your legs shackled together. All right. What? Everyone knows you're the one that needs your legs tied together. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> nice. Wow. That thing I know as the rest of the Heart Foundation knows, you're nothing but a homo. And that guy there in the green shirt is nothing but a homo. You are selfish. And you can't do anything for yourself. That Fifi isn't the only f in this ring. Wow. You are still without a shadow of a doubt the biggest asshole walking God's green earth. <laughs> wow. Well, Shane, I don't even think you have a strudel. I'm gonna beat you down like the bitch you are. Oh, take her this time was so savage. I'm this generation's Eddie Guerrero. No, you're not. <laughs> you're just a wannabe gangster who hides behind Rey Mysterio's shadow. I hate Dominic. You're the generation of um, James Ellsworth. Oh my god. <laughs> he compared to James Ellsworth. Oh my god. <laughs> that is the best thing I think I just heard. <laughs> oh dear. Kind of like the Stanley Cup. They'll never see it in their lifetime. Oh, our lives were so savage. Like you, uh... Winning a WWE Championship. Yeah. <laughs> That's not like it's gonna happen either. I, I, I'm so sorry. I have a gift for you and AJ. Please tell me your gift is you're retiring. Oh my god, that. Oh, John Cena back then was kind of savage, but was a good guy. That's all it is. The only door you ever knocked down was the door to John Cena's bedroom. Oh my fucking god. I hear that always, but it's still good. And it was true. <laughs> because they were John Cena and Nikki Bella were in a relationship. Oh my god. <laughs> What's the matter? You don't want to fight me in front of your family? You're a coward. Deep down inside, Dominic knows it. Leah knows it. All these people here know it, Ray. You're a coward. I'll even drop down to your level, Ray. See, Punk at that time is was a massive savage, being a straight edge. That's what it was. Like it's really damn good. <laughs> it was really good. Like thousands of other women. You want to walk with Elias? I have to break it to you, Trish. I don't date women in their sixties. <laughs> Trish is not even 60, she, she's probably like in her late 40s now, and she's still, in, she's still an amazing person. You don't see Becky Lynch walking around here holding a pair of testicles, do you? But if I did, they'd be a whole lot bigger than yours. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Don't worry, Wendy. 
Daddy's coming home tonight. Oh, Samoa Joe. Made you a promise. Daddy was coming home. It looks like he's not, but I'll be your new daddy. Wow, Samoa Joe and AJ Styles. Oh, the, this feud was so good. It could have gone better though, but they savagely was so high up. So good. When are you going to step out behind this woman and be a man and face Jack Swagger at Battleground? Maybe this. Wow, wow, that's mad. This is about Becky being better than Charlotte. You're out here thinking that you're a Marine in front of these people. Oh, oh, going back to, I think, Mrs. Hollywood or like Mrs. Film, the, the, the films that Mrs. has been in. Ouch. Listen to me, you big overgrown son of a b Then who's got the balls to step into the ring with me? The next guy that knocks you out of your Wait a minute! Oh, I hit Ric Flair is such a legend. You didn't know how to handle Braun Strowman, and you're never around to. You gotta be kidding me. You think you deserve a shot at this? You don't deserve buddy. Oh, Brock is such a savage. Oh my god, he's such a fucking savage. Hey, you look at me when I'm talking to you, or we can straighten this out right now. Oh, Samoa so Joe, I swear he's not. Like, he's not doing this for a character. He's definitely, like, so, like, savage and so lethal. God, he could have done well in the UFC or something. You in 10 years will be working as a waitress at Waffle House. <laughs> how, um, how the, how the turntables have tied. Was that? Let's, let's look at 10 years ago. This is this is probably like 2009-2010. Where's Mickey James right now? Still wrestling, but doing well for herself. Though it's the Miz, it's doing WWE. <laughs> Where was the last time he held a championship? Haha, <laughs> 2020. A little prick he is. Sorry, I just don't like the Miz. You just still sour because I've scored a pinfall off Maurice where you can't score it all. Well, that's a bit awkward as well, because now the Miz and Maurice are in a relationship and they're married and they have kids. Let's think about something romantic. Next week, a candlelit dinner and Kurt Angle having his way with your wife. Oh, not that fucking storyline. That storyline was mental. I can't believe W decided to make Kurt Angle... Uh, oh, no, I'm not saying that. That sounds fucked. Big Kane. Oh, I love this. I didn't get mad when you stole all my moves. The Take Us um, Hall of Fame uh, speech is probably one of the most best Hall of Fame speeches I ever watched. I just wa I watched all of it and I loved it. I loved Take Us so much. It's coming from a man who took a sacred vow of marriage to the biggest slut in the Western Hemisphere. Ouch. Oh, no. Why well, put off kicking somebody's ass next week? When I can do it right now. I just had a match before. Oh boy, you almost got beat by a damn rookie. <laughs> oh. Oh shit. I think he's referencing to John Cena, I think. I, I This might be... Uh, I think 2002. Taker was heel. Yeah, yeah, this this was like 2002. Because I remember Cena joined in. I want you to start looking around. Your daddy's not here anymore. Oh... Oh my god. The only television show you will ever be appearing on again is Total Divas. Oh Jesus. You're a lot taller than Ray. Are you sure you're not Eddie's son? Ooh. Oh, referencing to 2005. That was very clever from the Miz. But yeah, it's kind of true. Dominic's taller than Ray, so maybe? Definitely not. You're scared to death of your father's return because when he comes back, your time running this show is over. You spend as much time worrying about your own career as you did my leadership skills. Maybe you'd still be world champion. Oh, Stephanie McMahon. Oh, she's so good on the mic. She's such a savage. A savage. Savage? Savage. What the fuck? If I wanted to main event the Royal Rumble with a megastar, I would have chose your wife. <laughs> Oh, that's kind of awkward. Daddies, your uncles, your cousins, I love them all, but you two are assholes. 
Now that's a fat joke and I do not like fat jokes. So bad. Party's over, Grandpa. Okay, that definitely was definitely unscripted. That was not scripted at all, but what the fuck? That's fucked up to say. Bill Goldberg, just bring it, bitch! Oh my gosh! God. You're the brains of this operation. Your wife's the brawn. <laughs> Seth, I'm out here to disappoint you on multiple levels. Oh, like you do to your husband every single night? Oh! Again, the savagery. The savagery on this is fucking amazing. Oh, it, it's it's a cause, a savage problem. It's like, what the fuck? Jesus. It's how, a, was, it's, how was your movie, by the way? Oh, I missed I, it. Mine, mine went straight to DVD, just like yours. <laughs> <laughs> definitely, that's, that, that's definitely ruined their uh, acting careers. We look at John Cena. He's getting Hollywood films. Sitting here holding up three fingers. John, the middle one is for you. Keeping it PG, keeping it PG. Clever. The middle one's for you. Clever. My tag team division is full. But I hear that TNA is hiring. Jesus Christ. There's no need to bury. Oh. <laughs> that is sad. I, I, keep, I, need to keep, I need to stop saying this word savagery. Because it is savage moments. But this is really good. My nose is a bit big, and from up here I can smell you. Maybe you should take a shower, buddy. Wow. Let's talk about your kids. I don't give a sh** for kids. Oh, poor Heath Slater. Oh. This is like the time I think I started getting sympathy for Heath Slater because he didn't get drafted to any roster. What the fuck? <laughs> As everybody knows, the French don't take showers. Wow. Horse. I carry this huge, incredible wagon all by myself. Bullsh**, John. Uh -oh. Dear. I mean, after all, you're the one sleeping with him. Okay, ref. Okay, that's breaking the third wall. It's 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 the third or the fourth wall. I think it's one of those two. I may be wrong. But ref is seeing a marriage as that nobody heard of, of Renee Young or now. What's her name? Renee Pacquiao or what it is? And Dean Ambrose or now known as John Moxley. Also, the reference into the big nose, Trevor H has a big nose apparently. You need to watch your mouth, rich boy. People thought he said bitch boys. He said rich boy. Don't know. Let me take you back to WrestleMania two years ago. Your legacy died. Clever. The very day that you were born, you've been your daddy's. Take it 2016, I did not know well, to think about this, like, it's Taker versus Shane. Like, it was definitely not going to be a good match, but it was decent, especially when Shane jumped off Hell in a Cell. But what the f... But the savagery like that is kind of clever. The big dog let his bitches off the leash, so... <laughs> you know what's good, just don't get all rated R like your boy Xavier Woods. The fuck? Oh my god. That line is fucked up. You were absolutely nothing till your wife put you on total diva. Ouch. You're big on getting in people's faces. Oh, dusty, 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 dusty. Rest in peace, my war oh, legend. But just doing that to Stephanie Mount's face, that's kind of messed up. Cross the line, old man. Cross the line. I say you're the game with no balls. Oh. Thank Vince McMahon. Ha, he can't fire me. <laughs> <laughs> he will buy that piss and company just to fire you again. Oh my god. That's calling AEW a PS and company. Now, it's doing alright, but it's not doing better than WWE, I can tell you that. And after I beat Orlando Jordan, JBL for being the WWE's biggest b Ronda Rousey, I call you the single biggest bitch I've ever met. 
So that's going to be it for this reaction. I hope you guys did enjoy the reaction. If you did, do always leave a like and also subscribe to the channel if you're new around here. One on the road to 400 subscribers. If you have not subscribed, what the hell are you doing? It's free to do. So hit that big red button down below. All right. See you guys very soon for a brand new video. And I just hit my hand on the table. Thank you guys so much for watching. And see you guys very soon. Peace.